Hello, my name is Shotlia, and welcome back to another episode of Impressor Row Multiplayer. And once again, I'm joined by Benjamin Magnus, Commissioner Roach, Moss, and, and Mitch Man. Say hello, gentlemen. Hello. Hello. Good and dark, Fraulein's. And I know that at least myself and Ben are currently fighting a war. Yeah, there's some things happening in places. <laughs> in places. I'm trying to improve my nation slowly. Very slowly. The road building continues, because that's what we do. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing the same. Basically connecting uh, like the main uh, the main roadways to strategic locations. Yeah. I'm current. I'm building a Byzantium to my capital road, and I've just started work on the uh, capital to Athens road, which is not going to be able to be completed because of Botia in the in the way. What are roads? Uh, where you're going, you don't need roads. There's just That's a really for sure. nice path. That really Too many trees in the way, really. Too much of a hassle. <laughs> well, there we go. I'm at I, how now. would you explain roads? Have you? Soft flooring that you walk on. Mm, the how grass it... is green. <laughs> Long pile <path>, flat dirt. <laughs> <laughs> that actually sounds slightly familiar. <laughs> Oddly. Okay, let's go. Stability 2, please. Tax research points, yes. Better. <clears throat> At least I don't have to convert anybody from Druidic. They're all Druidic. Oh, uh, yeah, going into like Iberia is a pain in the ass. Because <laughs> every. Not only that, there's two religions in Iberia. So I have to go through both of them if I want to yeah, go up. Yeah. Druidic and Iberic. Iberic. Okay. Yeah. Because they just have to be contrarian. They have to be different. Iberia always has to be different <laughs> until they're forced mm -hmm. not to. <laughs> oh, of course. I wonder if there's going to be very specific religious bonuses at some point. I hope so. Be yeah, nice. I do so. Would be nice. Pretty sure that it's something that down the line there will be a DLC for that. Mm -hmm. That's something you can always say about uh, Paradox Games. Is, uh, <laughs> sooner or later, there'll be a DLC for that. We'll flush it out later. Yep. yep. Unless we're talking about Stolaris. Yeah. <laughs> Let it go, Ben. I really wanted that game to be better than it was. <laughs> it got better. It, let's be honest. It's... It's still not a game I can just play for funsies, you know, on mm. a weekend or something. I don't know. I can. I, I don't I don't think it's that bad. I don't think it's bad. It's just boring. Oh, Persian regional power of Pontus is a thing. That is your army. There's a lot of P's in that sentence. <laughs> oh, I can't. Persian regional power of Pontus. Why can I not access the families of my name? I can't select the clan leaders. Wait, Ravashism is a thing in this? Wait, what? Well, what? I'm looking at, at Fort Defense on a fort I'm sieging down right now. It says plus 4.2 from Ravashism, but they didn't capitalize it, so it looks out of place. Oh, it's really yeah. It's very odd. Yeah, I actually wonder, do they even show that number somewhere? That's what I was, that's why I'm confused, because I don't remember seeing that anywhere, ever. There's just no way that I can interact with clan retinue leaders in another nation, is there? Nope. Not unless you click the army and find the general and go through it that yeah. way and hope that they're the clan leader. Yeah. No, you can't click to the armies. That's the problem. Even though they're my allies. I can see that it's led by Crixus Crescus, but I can't find him. Oh, you can when you're at war. Yeah, but you I'm just not need at to war. zoom in a little bit to see the general level. And then you click on that, that Roman number yeah. and you can actually bring in the general. Oh, hello. Look at that, you're loyal. That's not what I'm looking for. 
Oh, you're not loyal. Hmm. You have a druid leading one of your armies, Ben. So? That's cool. <laughs> Hey, if, oh, he, just, if he kills like, the savages, if he kills the savages, what does it matter? I just clicked <laughs> and I was like, did you oh. see the stats? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was like, fair, fair. But I was like, yeah, you're not Roman. <laughs> <laughs> He'll convert eventually, I'm sure of it. Or else. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, you can force him to. Go onto his character and uh, force conversion. He's not causing any issue right uh, now. Cheers for that, Zaid, because I was trying to find a way to inspire disloyalty. Yeah, no on problem. Their, on their biggest army. Who's also taking a lot of attrition in their capital, which is fun. Who died? Alright, so if I was to declare war on these... I just spent 1,500 gold on buildings. Ugh. That's a few. <laughs> well, that's... yeah. That's a fair amount. It's about a few. It's more than I can spend. Oh yeah, my point spike just went up. Macedon! Yeah, I'm at 668 right now. Been dropping off quite heavily. Oh, interesting. I'm... Although this is the health code, but if you refuse a call to a war, you don't get the peace deal. Or truce with the person. Hmm. Oh, so you could definitely you could actually backstab him if you're saying. Yeah, I'm actually contemplating that. Yeah. <laughs> of course you are. Mm, I'll let things progress naturally. Not more disloyalty. <clears throat> because they got themselves into pretty big war. Got themselves in a dilly of a pickle. So it's for oh, two I didn't realize this person is disloyal. Oh, yeah. Time to bribe some. Generals. Ivory, ivory. Hey, I just noticed something. Well, for the for the first time, I've noticed that this the 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 ticket the additive siege engineering finally actually adds up correctly. It does. Yeah, there's a plus two instead of us just getting stuck at plus one. Nice. We must have fixed that at some point. For those of you who don't know, um, there you you could get inventions for plus one siege engineering. That yep. never added on to the the the, the, uh, the sieges. Now it says plus two. That's great. Now all we need the to available do is... inventions. Is it visible anywhere else? That's a question. Uh, I don't think so. Yeah. Unless there's a tradition. Well, somewhere. yeah, there's in um, in the stats you might find some, but I don't think they stick. Come on. You're 53. Please die. So your son. Dude, you're much... people in this game last forever. Oh, I know. I know. Mm -hmm. I just want his much better son to take over. Well, I mean, his son has no finesse, which is a bit bad, but he, he'll be the Nobody... first person I've had. Nobody but has he... any finesse. Nobody ever has finesse. <laughs> I mean, my current ruler has seven finesse. That's but, still um, not very high. Yeah, no, but he has two oratory, and his son has nine oratory. Uh, I would rather have him king right now. I'm okay on tech, really. I'm 888. Like, give me. Give me oh, wow. Give me I'm some 666. Six, six, six. Uh, I got a flat three. Or yeah, most of us are in six. Yeah, but, but like, I am of the time period the center of technology, so. Like True. I said, I've got no, I've got no tribesmen in my nation. Like. That's not a button, is it? What? Tech levels. Nope. No. No, I tried looking for that in, in a couple of playthroughs. Couldn't oh find God. it. How is this possible? No, automatic. Roll a one, roll a two, roll a three, roll a four, roll a two, roll a three, roll a one. Come on! Oh shit, you're back. Oh, I integrated those guys. Huh. I 
finally gonna go after my old tribal vassal. They've got 38 cohorts. Yeah, roll the five. I'm actually, a little bit scared of that because they have a, a lot. And a three. What the fuck? Ah. If you like this, like this one again. I'll lose my damn mind. All right, Sicily is now totally Carthaginian. Okay. Ah, that's a shame. Yeah, it really is. It took a long there time. There were some lovely Greeks there. Well. Yeah. They're, well, no. Dead because Roach is a horrible, horrible. They weren't person. Greek. They were. They were part of the the Latin subgroup. Either way, Hellenic. Well, I haven't. I, they're still Hellenic religion. No, they caught. They, they came tonight. Uh, some of them are. They're still. They're still Hellenic there. Oh, okay. Yeah, in the north there. Yeah. Okay, these barbarians are starting to piss me off. <laughs> oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me! Another four. Ooh, ooh! Fridges rebellion's about to uh, break out. How is this statistically possible? Never mind on that war. Fuck. Okay. Uh... Oh no! No no! No, no, wrong location. Can you keel over and give me a general that's actually worth its salt? I might oh, have to see if I get pulled in on this. Oh, rebellion. finally! Oh my god, it feels so good! Gotta wait to see if I get pulled in on this rebellion. Otherwise, I could be at war with Phrygia. I was about to go, go declare a uh, an offensive war, which, which, which would be good. Next Don't want to two front that. Actually, I've probably set up uh, ultra assimilation over there. Ooh, see if we get to that. Now I can finally start building roads. Hey, that's cool. See, this is a weird thing. I have a civic well. advance six, but it says I can't build roads. Yeah, it needs to be higher than six, so you need seven. Oh, well, yeah, fuck. I was thought I thought it was six because it's listed six. Just, why don't you just say yeah, it's got to no. be seven? <laughs> <laughs> I've noticed a lot of tool tips. Oh, yep, rebel supported. I'm at war with Frigia. Oh, good. I'm gl so glad I didn't declare that war. My God. All right. Oh yes, loads of Fr Frigia's vassals have joined me. Somebody in Somebody just keel over. No. Oh, it's. Why am I so so let's go diplo map mode. Oh, because I'm losing provinces, of course. Yeah, okay, they're the ones I'm. Okay, annoyingly, it's all the small ones that I'm allied with. But it's a good chance to do some damage to Phrygia. Damage the Phrygians. Damn it. Ah, okay. Oh, no. Considering they're like my major enemy Take in this. Take the straight crossing, please. Oh, thank God. The blind man's dead. <laughs> <laughs> A horrible person. Wish it, wishing ill upon the blind for no reason. Didn't you... Don't your people, like, put, like, Christians into a coliseum? Well, I guess it's not for a little Ooh. while. <laughs> it's gonna be a while, yeah. It's gonna be a, lo a little while. Well, Who no, you, st Christian you still throw slaves into Colosseum to get it eaten by tigers and shit. I don't know what you're talking about. There's no Colosseum yet. No, oh, when 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 is the Colosseum made actually? 60 AD. 60 AD. So we still got nine yeah. or something around there. Somewhere around there. We got about a hundred and hundred and something years. When was the Colosseum built? 70 AD. Ah, oh, I was off by a decade. Okay. I just stack wiped 20,000 Phrygians that were trapped in Crete. Yeah, you can't cross anymore. That's a wipe. Lovely. Are you my clan leader? Mm, no. Alright, get these cohorts. Where they need to be. Give you a triumph, though. 
Oh, you have to oh, chase I'm it. I nice built the first road already. Aha! I now oh, have a cognomen. Look one. how much a Phrygian like uh, Levant blew up. There's an independent Galilee, Judea. It's fantastic. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a bit. Yeah. Oh, so. Looks like the in about... the instability of the Middle oh, wow. East is starting early. <laughs> yeah. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thanks. So, so I now have a clan the British. Chief. I have a female clan chief who is called the Prince. I think you'll need to code oh, that part of yeah, it. Oh, yeah. Uh, that not the first time I've seen that one. Mm. <laughs> Bit of a shame. This woman is the king. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I had that. I, I screenshotted it and everything. It's in my uh, written game. Yeah, you're saying Nicomedia. Why are you running this way? That's not that's not what the rebels are or will be. Oh, you didn't join. Crisis in the Seleucids. Oh, it's it's. Go there. Everything's coming up, Midge man. All that precious civilization I had going gone. Unless uh, I separate yep. peace from this war, though, I don't. I won't get anything, so I don't want to set my troops in too hard, you know? Oh, fuck you. This is just to, you know, make them explode. Oh, wow. Like, why are you on really... local autonomy? This place is, is like one of the core provinces. There's nothing wrong here. Everybody loves it. Pretty much. Acquisition of wealth it is. And why are you on bleed them dry? It's, oh, I guess that's fine. <laughs> I don't like bleed them dry you at bleed, all. You, you bleed, you, you bleed them if you need to bleed them. Whatever. But like this one, you should still be on cultural assimilation. Mm. Yeah, it's like every time, every time there's a new one, it doesn't hold over. The new new governor just immediately implements a new oh. pro policy every time. And it's it usually there. something fucking random that doesn't make any goddamn sense. Yeah. I completed my road project just in time for this war as well. I mean, Ben, look at the road. It's uh, magnificent. It's quite glorious. Oh, I had to zoom in to find it. <laughs> oh, wow. And it does lead to Rome. It does. Technically, yes, it does. All the way. All right, Diplo range up. Ooh. Ooh. Elections are coming. So this is a so show superiority war. Yeah. Yeah. You're paying for those. So many nations that Most Phrygia. Uh, like if you click Phrygia and see the stuff that they're at war with, it's actually a little. It's not as scary as it looks, but. I am going to say, it's not that's you. <laughs> yeah. uh, and a lot of smaller states, but it's just breaking them up so much and ble bleeding their manpower and. It feels good to have an economy going. Good <laughs> thing. Feels good for money to exist. Mm. <laughs> oh, 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 I can get I can get companion cavalry and get cavalry skirmish techniques. Too good. Mercantile faction. That's diplomatic reputation. National commerce. To wait till the one is ticked over. Uh, oh, duel to the death. Let's see. Between somebody who's cancer and somebody who is lax. Duel to the death. Cancer versus du old duel age. Duel to the death. It is. <laughs> Fight. Right. One died. <laughs> one survived. The Loriga died. Well, the one with cancer died, so that's fine. Does that mean I, I have another warband? Yes. Enemy fleets. If you see the Phrygian navy, you destroy it. Goodbye. 
To victory, that guy gained Conqueror. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Ah, oh no my. Prominence, assault ability, and tributary opinion of us. Are you wealthy? No, you're not. Okay. Hey, Just level four, specific advance. Thank you. <sighs> Slowly but steadily, my nation is becoming more civil. That's cool. That's good. Most importantly, more civilized than my southern neighbor. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, frankly, that's all that matters. Mm-hmm. Honestly, yep. Is this Egyptian revolt six, six, ever six, going six, to six, end? Six. I don't I know. I don't think so. Don't think so. Just gonna go on. Not until I get down there and do something about it. I mean, it's all desert. Probably both sides have run out of manpower ages ago. Uh, no, the revolt still has 13,000 oh in the bank. God. And the Egypt still has 14,000 so in the bank. <laughs> so you guys are, what, six and seven? Around there. Yeah, around uh, there. Except around for there. Midge, who's the yeah. aberrant. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I have an OPM here who is an 8989. I'm a 9888. So well, that one, that one dude is really into uh, primitive technology. <laughs> he well, is he, that one dude in the forest. He's just so. that guy. Yeah, he's, yeah, he has six citizens and four freemen, and that's it. I can't wait till he finally makes iron and just... Call to arms and Coritania against... It's gonna happen sooner or later. Mm-hmm. Yep, and then in... He's got, like, little, little iron, well, like, rivlets. I mean, yeah. if you look at my vassal state Give of it, Argos, you know, uh, they're... They Give it 20 are, years, um, he'll make a car. 11, 10, yep. 11, 10. That or he'll do that thing, like, uh, it'll be like Gilligan's Island. He has a radio set out of coconuts and <laughs> the stuff that the professor made. Mm. Wow, that's a really old reference. Well, if I you guys don't know, arms, so. the, the, that was a our, really old reference. If for our viewers, that, that reference is probably older than me. Yeah, Roach. for our viewers, there used to be a show called Gilligan's Island, uh, yep. that in which in which a people uh, were stranded on an island, and the uh, the uh, there was a whole bunch of characters, but the named character was Gilligan. It was the it was a dopey guy that wore a cap and a red shirt, and it's kind of. Yeah, it was just kind of, it was comedy. And they had a guy called The Professor. I don't think he actually had his name. The Professor. Uh, and uh, and he made a whole bunch of stuff that was impossible out of coconuts Isn't and that the, who The Professor and Family, uh, family uh, Future Armor is, like, based off of? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think so. Uh, I, actually, now that I think about it, the only people who had names were, because there was, was everybody but The Professor. The Professor never had a name, I don't think. They just called him The Professor. I can't remember. Oh, you just kill them all. That's all. Okay. Well. Not for long, you ain't. Why does this fleet have 26 ships? Oh, they captured a pirate ship. Yar, har, fiddle dee dee. I was just wondering. I like keeping my, uh. My, uh. Fleets in an orderly, f uh, way. I think I need three more oratory advances than than I can reform into a kingdom. Hey, that's cool. Nice. Very nice. <clears throat> Medio Lanum, that's Manchester, right? Yes. Well, close to, yeah. Yeah. Got a lot of my troops there. Ah, oh, there's a lot of Jews in Sparta. Okay, that... Mm, is that a problem for you? I think that was mostly an observation. What is it? Okay. Oh, I mean, I've just converted them all. I was gonna so... say, there's no Jews there that I can see, so you just erased them. <laughs> <laughs> you get, erased is such a strong word. This they cease to be, Midge! I don't know what else you want to from say. the German... Mm-hmm. What? He's, he's the one that did it. He went out of there way. No, nope, you're the bad guy here. And just... I'm, getting, I'm getting the chance to modernize my military. Oh. Oh, uh, Mario yes, reforms? Slightly sharper sword. Wait, no, that's Roman. Why, why would he have Mar 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 Yeah, Mar I was just thinking, wait, he, you're not playing Roman. I mean, I guess if I invaded Rome, I could get it, but... Uh, not sure. No, it was the um, uh, Agrothiglatian reforms or something. 
or as hereby they will be known, the Pig Latin reforms. But we are actually out of time for this episode, so we we've enjoyed this. Why does this go so quickly? <laughs> it's only yeah. 25 minutes. Yeah. But anyway, uh, if you enjoyed this, please do like, comment, subscribe. If you haven't already, also check out the other players' respectives. Links are down below in the description. But other than that, thank you very much for watching, and until next time, bye-bye. Bye. Bye, bye, bye guys.